We are ES.genius, uh, and today we are reporting on the ESG data collection and reporting automation in the software entertainment industry. Real quick, I'm Lauren. Just going to do a quick overview of some of the things we're going to talk about today. First, we're going to go on to a little bit of an industry background. Then we're going to talk a bit about a problem that we've discovered. Going further into what our solution for that looks like and our strategy then behind it. The software entertainment industry, also known as the video game or gaming industry, has seen a uh, significant and unique growth since 2019 due in large part to the influence of the uh, COVID-19 quarantines. Due to its relatively short history, though, uh, many are unaware of the climate impact and sheer amount of energy it takes to produce, post, and play the games that are now a standard form of entertainment for over 3 billion users worldwide. Difficulty in tracking, reporting, and community communicating ESG data is not unique to the software entertainment industry. However, the industry's placement between tech and manufacturing makes it an ideal candidate for developing, testing, and producing a program that could uh, pull from more accessible data for the gaming industry rather than other uh, industries that have more complex pipelines. Our capstone takes a look at the relationship between stakeholders in the uh, gaming industry and uh, the data processes that are supported by artificial intelligence. AI-assisted collection, generation, and comparison of ESG data across industry stakeholders goes further to ensure that accurately reported uh, progress leads to a more sustainable, future-proof economy. We're going to go over a couple of uh, two big issues, ESG annual reporting and um, computer programming languages. Scopes are the areas in which climate consequences, climate consequences, consequences are developed in a uh, company's pipeline. We're going to look at subsidiaries and acquisitions, which are private organizations that a larger public company has a majority share in, or uh, yeah, uh, an appendix. Oops, oops. In appendixes, <laughs> that's a section of an ESG annual report with relevant data. Uh, lastly, we're going to look at artificial intelligence, a computer programming language that deals with predominantly qualitative data and uh, rule based coding, which is its counterpart that is using if then number based uh, languages. Okay, so the problem. Um, this map you are seeing right now highlights the issue of ESG, uh, ESG reporting in the industry, which is caused by a need for more communication and regulation between producer and investor. As a result, relevant data is not reported, and both parties lack pressure and insight into each other's expectations and processes. So we started by laying out the problems that we saw in the uh, video game industry and uh, set problems that we saw in regards to sustainability risk and climate impact, and we separated them out by scope. Uh, then we uh, did some research on opportunities that directly correlated to the original threat to see where we could maximize our impact and uh, maximize our impact. Uh, next, our next steps were to uh, evaluate what value we could bring to the stakeholders and what that might look like with an AI tool set. Okay, so through our research, we have found two critical problems within the industry that has limited investment in sustainable technology. So the first is the customer lack awareness about environmental impact of video games, and they hesitate to change their gaming habit despite climate change. Also, producers have little incentive to form more sustainability practice, and there is no form of accountability for sustainable investment. So as the market continues to expand rapidly, game producer and studio have the opportunity to use their position between manufacturing and tech to develop an advantage toward net zero economy. So in our future innovative design, we will focus US, uh, UNSDG 17 partnership for the goal and key indicators such as registered company and investor, sustainability project, and yes, renting 
we will develop a system where goals, target, and resources can be counted for and easily shared. In addition, we will focus on US DG7, affordable and clean energy, nine innovation and infrastructure, and also 12, responsible consumption and production to drive the enterprise transformation and promote sustainable development. So based on uh, the problem, here's come our research question. In what way can sustainability be implemented into the software entertainment industry? Here's our solution. So ES Genius is an AI-driven ESG tracking and reporting software concept with online published results and communication. We make it easy for a company to track, plan, and publish ESG reports uh, for investors and consumers alike. When it comes to our design approaches, we are aiming to encourage companies to implement sustainability action through our platform that enables generate ESG report and connect with investors and public. And we also approach to all with understandable information as well. And here's our logo. Let's see it together. For the company, as our customer, we will provide our own product own process for our customers to set up their sustainability goals in an easy way like this. They just click a few type, few steps. And after the in initial legislation, companies will have opportunities to connect with investors and get further suggestions on how to achieve green efficiency. And we will help them manage their sustainability activities and issues based on our AI technology, and our customers are able to generate sustainability report as well. And for the investors, we will help the investors connect with appropriate company with long-term sustainability approaches. Through our, our platform, investors are able to follow companies and get updated information promptly. They can request directly to their company. And for the public, we aim to enhance use, user education and participation and raise sustainability awareness by updating our platform with relevant news and certified companies. We believe that sustainable company certification helps not only build a more resilient organization, but also business cut costs increase sales and gain a competitive advantages. And also investors are able to strengthen their portfolio with sustainable organizations. That brings us to our data model, a visual representation of our data model, which is a list of programs and uh, <laughs> input options that we will use to inform our AI engine. We're using uh, PWC's auditing, uh, ESG auditing structure, uh, BlackRock, Vanguard, and Process sustainability and investment requirements, as well as sustainalytic data points to teach and inform our model. Each dot represents a category that will be measured for our cert sustainability certification. And each square here represents both internal and external sources that support that category. So for example, one of the 39 categories that we look at in our AI-assisted audit is workplace diversity. So our internal data point, data collection point for that would be ADP. Using ADP, we'll be able to collect uh, demographic information on each employee. Our external data point for that would be uh, LinkedIn and or OpenAI's uh, data database. Um, using more than one uh, data point for each uh, uh, category, we get a better idea of uh, how a company operates. So the situation is the participation in ESG planning and reporting uh, among gaming companies is low. The awareness of the environmental impact among users is insufficient, and the corporate transparency is also low. We would input a small team of, uh, uh, of software engineers, UI designers, as well as partner relations specialists. 
We would also uh, put more research into our uh, risk and stakeholders, uh, an analyzing where we can uh, uh, mitigate risk. And we would also um, use our roadmap informed by KPIs and our ESG requirement list. Um, our small team would mobilize after investment to um, achieve our key activities, mainly uh, collecting more information on our market, uh, our customer base, as well as uh, building relationships with partners in order to create buzz, uh, make connections, and refine our program further. Long term, our program would be used in more diverse industries and would be outfitted for more complex pipelines. Okay, here's our business model. It's pretty uh, straightforward. Um, but then companies will uh, submit their uh, documents for ver verification uh, when they register account, and we will charge them the registration fee annually, as, as shows on the chart. Our primary stakeholders are individual users, gaming industry companies, and investors within the, uh, within the industry, as well as investors of Yes Genius. Our platform not only serves as a uh, information bridge for the public uh, companies and also investors, but also contributes to the sustainable development of gaming industry. In addition, our business model will generate profits for our own uh, investors. We plan to promote our products by partnering with industry leaders, uh, participating in exhibitions, for example, the Gaming Develop Development Conference, uh, and also expanding our network. Our goal is to showcase our products to companies and investors to invest in sustainable practices. The partnerships that we have built to develop the software for data collection will serve us as we distribute our program to companies. A program like uh, Oracle ADP, um, they already have a really huge user base, so uh, we want to uh, try to reach them after development. And in terms of the environment, we hope to encourage more uh, companies change to use the clean energy and have more exposure through their uh, quality ESG reputation. Uh, at the societal level, ESGenius will provide an information exchange platform for the, uh, for the industry, uh, creating a unique community uh, environment uh, to increase people's awareness of sustainable development. Economically, we will focus on discovering more uh, great ESG projects to, to attract more uh, green uh, investment. Uh, culturally, we aim to increase public attention to the sustainable development of the gaming industry through uh, carbon footprint monitoring and, uh, and also other functions we have on our platform. Our first year capitalization request will be $859,950, which includes the startup cost and also the first year monthly expenses. Okay, so um, here's our SWOT analysis. The major strengths are, uh, first, the software can provide users with a platform for information exchange, and also we have various services. Also, we have a complete privacy policy to protect all users. For the weaknesses, we require a large amount of investment to ensure uh, stable operation. Also need a lot of publicity to increase the number of users. For the opportunity, we establish a sustainable development discussion community. Also, we summarize multi-resources suggestion to improve the industry. This platform can touch more industry besides the gaming industry. For the strength, the development process consume our energy and increase carbon emission, and also need to improve technical support to improve the system to improve the system regularly. So, in conclusion, we found three key issues whenever we were researching uh, our problem, and that is that corporate transparency is low, that awareness on the climate impact is insufficient and that communication among stake stakeholders in the industry is also low. ES Genius would make it easy to track and report um, sustainability progress uh, to share and um, update <laughs> across the, uh, the industry as a whole. Thank you.